I think of sanctuary, sanctuary away from what's steaming and boiling away as just a condition that is the condition found um, as a result of one side of the organism that is uh, living a bit in denial about something. Maybe there is a little distortion behind what is making it behave the way it does. And this is an across the board thing. Now we're talking about the world itself. Um, where can we go where this is a, a legitimate conversation and that we have some good food and, and we just have, you know, we've gotten that locked down at least for ourselves because then next we can get, keep our awareness up. And, you know, the, the, the water is important. You want to keep water clean. And that's basically the three things. I mean, besides for a shelter now, we're talking about to have a conversation like this, you'd have to maybe have people around you and say, hey, you know, I th it's not so much a conversation ongoing with confusion, but it's more of a celebration. And, and that, that's another across the board kind of thing where what was it exactly that we did that kept the water really clean? And how's everything today? And how are you? And did you eat yet? And how's the food? And stuff like that. It should be really a celebration. Did I mention that? Just like to to, to say, hey, this is it. Um, that's what any, you know, I've tried to talk about talking in my last video, and there's only two types of forms. One of them is very much a celebration, and there are some cultures, you can imagine, they could be living here on this planet, but they don't talk about it very well. Uh, you know, it's just because it, it's beyond talking. They, they, they don't talk. It's not chatter. It's singing. They're singing to each other, and the way that the male and female sound is an interweaving because one has a different way of speaking. Uh, it's a completely, it's like using its vowels in a different way and then the man. And all it is, once again, is it's a celebration. What the fuck is going on around us? Yes, and we are still maintaining our intellectual properties as such that is keeping not only our situation healthy and all living things around it green and, and the possibility that could, may, might be there within that civilization that is maintaining a vibrational frequency on high that begins to work its works its sciences to harmonize in such a way that now we have, look at the structures that could, may, might be left behind by that kind of intelligence that says just says, hey, it's possible to have this. Why and why would we want it? Because that's what's kind of necessary. Let's keep in the truth. In, in, in boogieing with the truth here, because um, yes, the the housing that lasts two thousand years and that create creates its own um, ideally creates its own weather systems. I mean, there's castle-sized cities. I can imagine made of material um, by the three D printing machines. Um, that there's some sites on this plane, babes, and I would love to look look at, run into those pictures again. Um, might have it somewhere on my computer out of the 10,000 pictures. And you can just see where um, something rested over a massive outcropping of granite and then made a beautiful statuesque castle that's like, we're supposed to believe that somebody carved it with their hands or something. It's like, no, it's just a technology that was, is, or what it is out there still not, not operating in front of our faces. We are here in, in cuckoo's nest fucking experiment. Do you think they'll figure it out on their own ever? <laughs> kind of can. And some of us are saying, when do we get the hell out of here? And Jesus is saying, you got to make that right sacrifice, man. Just say, you know what? The truth, and this is the thing, what I really wanted to talk about, and, and are we at Easter time yet? Who cares? Paint me up like an Easter egg. My my egg is done. Anyway, um, um, I'm a bleeder, babes. I, you know, we have red eggs. So no, God, no, yes. Uh, I was trying to talk about um that uh, that uh, story, you know, that that suggestion, whatever is happening. They're really what. 
what could may might have happened this is the truth for you if you ever just snap out of it and look at it you only have so much time here to see it and then what are you gonna do am i doing good jesus yeah you're almost good as me um so then what are you gonna do um is is you realize you just become realized it's like well wait a minute um that's what's happening to the presences here that um say uh oh no the truth is actually more important than people the illu i'm sorry the illusion of people the truth is not it will, will peel through this is really we talk about this but just in general there's the truth about people and then there's the truth about the truth you want to know you want to know like well what is more valuable here what is the thing that's going to so-called give us a i say so-called because what does constitution mean i want to i wanted to say um keeps our constitution up or gives us a good constitution i'm still confused what does constitution mean it's been blasted away by some political parties man everything that they say is turn is like a collage of whoo you ever it's beyond bull crap you know what i mean it's like this this we can't even use it like fertilizer none it's not coming from any fucking place except for the living death cult system that boy all you have to do is just say yes to this complete no to your own intelligence and you're on it you are the ruling class welcome to the world and what are you going to do kids i was just talking about christ jesus over there and the possibility of figuring something out before you waste this entire life without a question or an examination about this conversation that you need to have really was it worth a damn and look at, like this um what was that you know i mean it's just a story right and are we supposed to believe that that's that's done and now we just pfft, keep steaming away and, and frothing over in in what more and more babes the stories that at least if you were listening to the words and really i think it was just a good scientist that knows and anybody will tell you right now yeah no it's still on jesus time and, and we're heading towards uh the dark ages as far as what we're about to see um see um you don't let darkness and or ignorance stupidity um take over you just try to Try to shed enough light on it to where I, this is the experience, babes. You've got to become enough light. This is just what's going to happen. And it's going to be looking terrible. It's going to be looking strange. It's going to get so strange looking and weird. The main thing is pay attention to how you feel. Stay in a healing mode. Staying, staying in a healing mode. And this is where I'm getting back to God. Where, where are our people? Where are the people that live? knowing not to be so secondhand smokish and what i mean is it's no not the smoke out of my chimney pardon that by the way that was something that i don't usually do you know it's kind of weird with the neptunian aspects right now Whew. um no i'm not talking literally like that you can only wish i was i'm talking about the the crap that is spewed out via using the minds of the masses who don't know any better that do literally use toxic things and now I don't know how I began this video, but it, it 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 kind of I'm sitting here puzzled about it's like okay, so I have to move because it used to be a certain way, but now it's not. It's just a crib for the big baby society who are dangerous to each other and even themselves, unhealthy and icky. They're not up here for the mountains, not really. They don't know anything about it. They're wondering what what's going on here. Well, it's the mountains. God, I hope it fucking snows five feet here coming up this March. It could still happen, and people, you know, it's weird you know i i just happen to be you know you, you want to hear my story it's like no we remember when it was a community that cared that they that the intention was that to keep it the sanctuary that it truly was and that wasn't too long ago you know and and uh, it, it really didn't matter you know it, it does matter but see the, the kind of people what I mean is it doesn't matter about the environment but it does because the environment begins to reflect the kind of people that are around and what it has turned into is just uh, yeah it's obvious that the system is running a mental imprisonment really there's ugh, it's war it's 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 a it's a stench of the warlord's desire to have people 
programmed in a certain way that it doesn't matter how it's going as far as that programming. But the main thing, what I mean is whatever it does, never figure out your own intelligence enough and especially don't acknowledge each other, right? Don't get together and get anything on your own going, not even a fucking single strawberry patch and be completely dependent on our poisons. Yep. And more and more, it's just, here it is. Here, have some fucking free asphalt. You know, that stuff, sorry, I don't, that right there is an original offense that is like, because I still smell it, especially after the, the first rains and the, the melting of the snow. It's like, uh, usually you want to smell something fresh. And it's like, babes, I've lived in the shitty, I've lived in the city, and we can't be impressed with with adjusting or having a healthy uh, adjustment, you know, adjusting to the profoundly sick society. It is no measure of good health to be well adjusted to the profoundly sick society. And now I'm going to turn this into a little bit of an astrology um, video because I think I should do that um, more. I should put my astrology videos and kind of long rants as an excuse to put this up ahead in March 26th. It's not even the end of, um, it's February 29th right now, I'm just, that was, this was the hardest month, and it's just whatever with the most terrible thing that I experienced about, it's actually a beneficial experience that I just had, it's like, ugh, this is actually real, this will really make you sick, huh, Jesus, to the point of what, yeah, it's looking like suicide, isn't it, yeah, yeah, it does, and a lot of people don't really admire you, no, of course not, not especially these stupid fucking idiots called Christians, well, look out, girl. You don't just pretend like I said this. I can give a shit about Christians. Christ. That was not my last name. <laughs> Nobody knows what Christ meant. Not to this day. And it's just a state having um, right, risen above, say, the mind, really. Christ means now, if you really want to know. Is is what is, and the truth is that, and did you clear it out and fucking find out? Anything substantial enough for a kid to appreciate? No? Poor kids. Poor fucking kids. Getting back to the asylum that it really is down here. Uh, whew, I'll be right there. You're doing good, girl. Oh, and the way that you make a... Um, these people shit their pants around you to say just say something like, "Well, um, the truth has more power than over your mind than and the mind does eventually." You know that's what they say. It's just you can't. There's three things you can't um, hide forever: is the sun, the moon, and the truth, uh, or something like I don't know. But but see, they have they're so warped in their minds about stuff, and it's like. Um, they are they they have cut out pardon me they have cut out a factor of let alone that they have shut their account on reality and it's supposed to be that um this is what's really peculiar and i want to really talk about this as it's the subject of narcissism i think it's because it's in the air mars and in aquarius i have known so many mars and aquarius and they are 100 percent like naturally see it's a natural thing to be manipulative to get things we start that early to try and get things into us and it shouldn't be such a fucking absurd show to where um, now now you're really it's just a charades game, right? Where you're accepted into the club and the idea or the ideal is to actually turn on the people that get their needs met because they they adhere to the truth better and they're rewarded genuinely and they get fed and they're, the truth feeds them, not um, not a rewards punishment system. If you don't get the truth down right, it's simple. Um, if you, if you want to make a scrambled egg or something and you don't get the truth down, if you don't get the heat adjusted right, the right butter in there, and a certain timing, uh, boy, you know, if you don't get that down right, you're going to end up with the shittiest eggs. And the people who get it right with love really is the way to get truth right. Only with love. Love is ability, an ability to be present without mind, but the heart is dialing into the truth there. It's like, well... It's an experience you're just going to have to dare have. Damn! We're going to go round and round in circles with Auntie Shauna. It's the same for everybody. It's the same for everybody. I didn't just say that. Jesus, did you say something like this? Yes, and be careful, girl. 
narcissist, first of all, is like, what do you mean it's the same for everybody? They want to be so very unique, right? And it's like, well, yeah, you are, but basically, come on, what's the truth about uniqueness? It's the same for everybody. Look into it more. Keep looking, keep looking, keep looking. God, it's such an elementary fucking subject matter. But it's so important to keep, to keep talking about it. It's, this conversation is missing from the get-go, and that's why we have such a fucking problem. That nobody even thinks that's a, a, what's the conversation about the truth? The truth, the nature of the truth and the nature of people. The truth about people and the truth about truth. See, I wanted to talk about minute 15. Good. Um, putting this up on, see, what's going to happen is, okay, let's look at Mercury. Now, let's look at everything right now. There is a conjunction right on top of my Jupiter with Saturn, Mercury, and the Sun. It's been such a, a interesting study. The main thing is that did you know that we we can hardly have our spiritual lives if we did have one that if it meant that we actually would know God and, and or the truth to sort all of that out and start making sense at any point. It's it's nearly impossible. The society is void of that intelligence. They've gone more. <clears throat> what I mean is, man, you know, that intelligence, your spirituality, there isn't. That's what we're, babe, haven't you had a wonder of what is actually happening here? Did you ever question what is going on here? How did I get here? Where did I come from? No. See, that, that holy curiosity and, and really feeling the experience that you're having as as a human body getting more and more just maybe you can disconnect from it so you have to get through the fear of just get through the fear Let's see if, if, if you if you think that you know god i hate this conversation by the way when when i start falling into thinking i have to explain everything because for sure we're talking that there's narcissists that at the end of christ jesus story over there looks up and says, God, these people don't know what they're doing. In other words, they're stupid. So you can't, we can't do much here. Don't punish them. Forgive them. You forgive them. That's the, really that person is making a statement, just an innocent statement. Oh, by the way, we forgive you because you don't know what you're doing. And until you do, you can't be held accountable. You don't have an account opened yet with God and or reality. Goodbye. You know, um, Jesus asked Father to forgive um, us. Didn't say at all that, that she did. Oh, still rolling. And so then the sacrifice that was made, this is really what I wanted to talk about. Suppose it, you know, it's, it's, it's like this. Um, of course, if, if you were a really good scientist, if you were a fucking top-notch scientist, like, like if it really was, you know, that like Tesla really had that this ability, and I don't think Jesus was um, at all a male figure. I think she was a woman, and she said, "This is what's left. What we do with our our technology. If we can't work it, we destroy it." Um, she says, um, "I will sacrifice my body so that you will know that the truth exists." Me as people, like what you think is Jesus, when really it's just Christ. The Christ, any Christ, is sacrificing themselves so that the truth may keep the entire organism buoyant, whatever touches it however to intelligent it is. And then while we're talking about the potential to become a human being, and I stick with my philosophy and theory that even though it looks like that there's, it's happening here, there's very few that are actually actual human beings. Very few are born as human beings or they are born that way and they are destroyed. That's what narcissism is. That's your favorite Subject matter of narcissist babes. We're talking about the sense of self, the sense of being. I would. I don't want to say who we are, but especially how we are. Is vacated with from them because they've been told no in so many ways, and they've been installed with something of now. You can just point out the system that is actually it's just remarkable, because that programming 
is geared to help out the system to keep something down. Now, I'm telling you, the money system, why do we need it if we didn't just close our account with reality and how to get along with each other and maintain a decent human relationship and especially make good use of our technologies and things? Money is saying, no, you're losing. You're losing your your the discipline and the um, you're getting sicker and sicker basically there's a part of the society that says no i can't make it but here take this money <laughs> and from anywhere from like i can't wash my own windows i can't do my own laundry i can't fucking clean my own house i can't even be present in the mountains that i am can you make it look like that i've been here can you um uh you know because they just they're, they haven't been present really technically is not really graduating into the university universe Very few are making it here, babe. I don't want to end it now. I'm trying to, to clarify. I've been kind of poking around it. And please hit like if you're following this train. It's going to keep refining. It might not get any better until the year 2025, which is, of course, because it's, it's like it's going to go viral. It's like, I'm going to say, see, see, this is what I've been saying. The nature of the mind versus reality and then how that there's a philosophy that's, that's, that, that is the mind itself that says, no, follow me around. I'm the one, baby. If it if wasn't, if, you know, if it wasn't for me, then the rest of reality wouldn't be here. And it's like, uh, 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 you know, uh, uh, we can start talking at what level do you qualify to even say that um, as an, a scientific aperture? Hello, Jesus. Yeah, just science. I, I, I sacrificed myself for real science, for the real live holy truth that if we lose sight of it, we don't have much here. We don't have much but our paper clothing and our fucking babysat society who are just lethal. They don't know any better but to eat each other. Yes, eating each other energetically.